Hello! Welcome to Teardown, a new destruction game. But not just any old destruction game. This is the most realistic destruction game I have ever seen in my entire life. Although I haven't seen a whole lot of them. But this is definitely the best because everything, every single thing is destructible. You've got your campaign, your sandbox. I'm of course going to play the campaign and I will demonstrate what I mean with everything. With everything, I really mean everything. Everything's destructible. See this plant? Well, it's, it isn't a plant anymore. I've turned it in just a bit of broccoli or whatever this looks like. I don't know. Or this chair? Fuck this chair. And these windows? Nobody likes them. And oh, not only is the game ultra realistic with what you can break and how it breaks, it also has quite accurate physics, I would say. Everything can fall down. Even this huge building I'm in right now. Down it goes. Oh no, wait, that was right on top of my treadmill. God damn it. Ah, it's rainy, beautiful. It fits my mood. In this destruction game, you of course also have things like vehicles. Like this dump truck over here. With which I will demonstrate how amazing the physics in this game are. Just uh, need to get to where I need to get. Fuck this wall, nobody cares. And <laughs> look, half my vehicle is gone, but that doesn't matter, it still kind of drives. Here, you see that bridge over there? It doesn't look that sturdy. That's because it isn't very sturdy. I bet you when I drive over this, although I have successfully driven over, over this bridge with the dump truck, I bet it's going to collapse. Yep, indeed, it collapsed. And I don't know if you could see that, but the wood was actually bending. Whenever do you see bending wood in games? Because if this was any other game, the bridge would have just either collapsed immediately, when it got the signal, truck is going over bridge, so collapse bridge, or it would have just stayed intact and be invincible. But not in this game, no. It almost looked like the bridge was holding, but then it collapsed. Let's now restart and get a smaller vehicle. Look at how cute this little tractor is. Not only does it make an adorable sound, but it looks beautiful. Doesn't it? Oh, f me. Just pretend like that didn't happen. So yeah, very cool tractor. Now I bet you, when I try and drive this tractor over the bridge, instead of collapse, it will support it. I mean, it isn't going to go very well, because it's still f quite heavy, because it's a tractor. So if everything now goes all right, this bridge should not collapse under the weight of the tractor. Oh, it almost looked like it did. But it's holding up! Look at that! I mean- OH SHIT! Get to the other side, quick! <laughs> well, that's what I mean. Barely made it across. Beautiful. Yeah, I wouldn't drive over this bridge again uh, anytime soon. And when I said before that everything is destructible, I really mean everything. So it might not look like this is destructible now, or the metal in these windows. But I promise you, it is very much all destructible. Even the ground is destructible. I will demonstrate. This is probably meant to drag cars along and do useful shit. But I'm just going to use it as a battering ram. So we're aimed up. Ramming speed! No problem at all. Straight through the wall. The thickest part as well. And the vehicle is, it doesn't even look that bad. Now, all the way through. And just like that, we're inside the garage. And now we're outside again. Do you now get why I, I'm so fucking excited, uh, excited about this game? <laughs> now let's look, walk back through the carnage. This fucking thing's in half. Amazing. Oh, and did I mention already that there is fire? Although I don't think uh, uh, it will work very well in the rain. Oh no, it, burn it burns just fine. But enough about me rambling on about uh, how amazing this game is. Let's actually show what uh, the point is of this game. Because it isn't just this one map on which you can destroy literally everything. Oh, and the map's quite big, by the way. There. 
a couple of secrets uh, hidden uh, in it. No, the main goal of this game is actually missions. There are a bunch of missions over here. Uh, I've only unlocked three locations yet. And I think I'm just going to play the next mission in line, which I believe is a demolition mission. But there are all kinds of uh, missions in this game. Like one where you need to steal a bunch of documents or a car and loads more I haven't played yet. So this mission, making space is it's called. Over here we've got our escape vehicle, of course we can't escape yet. And then on the map we can see what our objective is. So look, quite a large map, right? So our goal, to remove this safe and I believe another safe over here, throw them into the ocean and then completely demolish this house cause some rich friend of mine wants to put his yacht over here. And apparently there isn't enough space or something like that. I don't really care about stories in these kinds of games. It's all about destruction for me. But first, look at the speed of this car. Oh, f So, our first thing we need to do, remove the safe out of this house. Ah, oh, look at how incredibly nice this looks. Uh, it's so incredibly detailed. Even this, this whatever snack bar, hot dog stand, it's... It, it didn't have to be designed uh, to the, the smallest level, but look, there's stuff on the shelves, there's stuff in the furnace, uh, everything's destructible. I almost feel bad for destroying whatever the fuck this is. I can hammer down the walls, I can hammer down this whatever refrigerator, I can hammer down this sink. Oh fucking hell! I didn't know it would explode right in my face. Well, good, it didn't kill me. So there's a boom inside of here, huh? Maybe I can take this and blow a... Uh, and blow the safe up that way. If I'm f***ing f***. Anyway, I'm getting off, off track here. My actual goal is to find the safe that's hiding somewhere inside of this... How fucking dare you, door? Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, in this game, you don't have to worry about doors. A very nice thing. <laughs> Look at this. It's still connected. Door is open. So, where's that safe hiding? Hello, any safes in here? No? Well, it doesn't matter, I'll just ram straight through the wall. Hiya! Aha! I have found the safe. I made the quickest and easiest path to it. We're all about efficiency here on, uh, on this channel. So, how the fuck am I going to get this heavy son of a bitch all the way over downstairs and into the sea hmm well let's first throw it downstairs and then drag it maybe oh wait i just got an idea yeah how about i use this one you picking up what i'm putting down oh but i see an unfortunate problem let's just remove that real quick all right that should be low enough now i know this field of flowers is beautiful but it needs to get out of my way now uh, let's line this up correctly and very carefully, because it's fragile, lower this thing down. Yes! Oh shit, there's already a hole in it. Get out of my way door! Alright, very carefully. Oh, that's not very careful! <gasps> Put it hold up. Now, inside of the car you go. I'm not used to my plans working out. Definitely not as well as they did. Now close the gates. And full speed into the ocean! Oh, I just realized I have to do two safes. Darn it! Then I need to find another way to get that other safe down. I'm sure I'll be able to figure out something. <laughs> oh! I've got another great idea. Yeah, so I've only ever used this gigantic uh, crane as a battering ram. How about I change that and actually use it, use it for its intended purpose? One tank coming through. Now, where have they hidden it over here? Well, there's only one room it can be. And there it is. So let's make another hole in the wall. Ooh, this wall's quite 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 thick. And look how <laughs> it even this even this wall even has 
different layers, like one layer of wood, one layer, two layers of in insulation, and a red layer, whatever that is, probably a different type of wood. How cool is that? Now, is that a crap all out of my way? Goodbye, and goodbye. Oh shit, I'm... Sometimes I don't even know my own strength. Hey, look! <laughs> I just noticed. There's a little smiley face on the side. Very weird mouth, long nose. Ah, why does everything have to always be in my way? Ah, very annoying. Oh, I still need that uh, long bit on the top. Yeah, this will work. I am a genius. Now, let's dump it into the ocean. No! Oh, shit! I thought there was still a layer below that. I didn't mean to sacrifice my truck. But whatever gets the job done. Cool physics bit number 76 or whatever I'm on now. Look! They've made a little uh, plastic tons. Those little plastic tons that hold up, I don't know, a raft. Or in this case, a pier. And they actually work. They don't sink. I would be able to make a raft out of this if I were smart and had crafting materials. Just little stuff like that. Attention to detail. That's what I like in my games. Now, let's take a boat and get back to the actual main objective of this game. No! Oh! I just... I think I just found a way to do it. I, get out of my way! Well then, if you don't budge, I've got alternative ways of getting in. Ah, uh, fuck you! Big ass motherfucking boat! Let's set sail, lads! On to the open seas! Just kidding, I'm going through the inside. Blast! The bridge is still closed. And we can go! Now I hope my computer can handle whatever's going to result out of the next couple of seconds. But it's time to ram this stupid house off, the, off this map. Time to make space! Oh fuck, the frame rate's dropping to two frames a second. Bloody hell, keep going! And please don't crash my PC! Yes, we've destroyed the house! B oh shit, we're also destroying a bit of that second house. Ah, there's still uh, one little bit of wall left. And mission complete! Now let's get the fuck out of here before the police notice us. Hmm, I'm suddenly curious, what happens if I ram my escape vehicle to the point I can't escape anymore? Do I then fail my mission? Never mind, apparently my escape vehicle is indestructible. Now let's get the fuck out of here, boys! A mission complete! Score 3, yes, I've got all my objectives. So that is one of the missions. Uh, there is of course a whole lot more. And there's this fun TV! The Mystery Show! Oh, I haven't seen this one. Normally there's only stupid news about how... Yeah, like this. The four ocean cabins at the West Point. I can't read that fast. Anyway, that's the mystery. How could that cabin have gone? I wonder. Definitely, it wasn't me. But yeah, there's there's also a bit, bit of story over here. But uh, nobody, boo, nobody cares. And there's tools you can buy. Like this shotgun. And I've got 600, uh, 600 bucks, so I'm going to uh, upgrade it a bit. Now my shotgun just became thicker. And I'm sure if I play more missions, I unlock way more uh, shit like the shotgun. And there's a whole load more missions. Like now, a, ca uh, a classic car where I need to steal a couple of cars. And the GPS devices where I need to steal a bunch of GPS devices. And escape before the police get me. More than enough fun to be had for... I don't know, a good few weeks of playing? And there's a whole lot more stuff in this game for the, to explore yourself, which I'm not going to show you, because of course, a little bit of a surprise is welcome from time to time. So I definitely recommend you buy this game. It's, it's amazing. You definitely won't regret it if you're at least a bit like me and a fan of destruction. That's my final verdict. Thanks for watching, thanks for watching, and hopefully see you later. Bye! Look, I can't even shotgun through the wall! Jesus Christ, I'm strong!
<laughs> I believe I've already found a glitch in this game, a way to br absolutely break the fuck out of this. <laughs> Look, you just take this little uh, stand, advertisement stand, chalkboard thing, and you put it upside down. I said you put it upside down. Yeah, like that, like that. Then put it in the direction you want to go. Like over here. Stand on it. Big, uh, grab on. Hold on tight. And walk forward. Oh, holy fuck. And you can fly across the map. And also break your legs apparently. Ah!